Welcome to the Brand Theory Podcast, the podcast for helping you uncover your passion, realize your purpose, and take the aligned action. Together, we're going to prove the theory that when we live our lives on brand, the possibilities become limitless. I'm your host, Danielle Marchesi, branding expert and business coach. Let's get started. Welcome back to another episode of the Brand Theory Podcast. We have some super exciting things to share and cover today, a topic that I have been so excited to research, talk about, and dive into, and I'm excited to bring that conversation to you all here today, and that is this topic of storytelling marketing. I don't know if you've been seeing anything about it other than my own stuff, Uh, if you've been reading anything about it, if you've been hearing other people talk about it, but it is really the future of marketing and branding in general. And I just find it so, so, so incredibly interesting and so relevant to today's times and just everything that we're kind of going through, but everything that we also want to see and want to be engaged in. So allow me to explain. There's no fluff in this. We're diving right in. (laughs) So I want you to think about your favorite books, movies, and TV shows. Whichever media you may prefer, there's one thing that they all have in common, and that's the story. The story is what draws us in, keeps us captivated until the end. It's got that excitement, that drama, the moments of despair, the moments that draw the emotion out of us. Maybe tearing up at the latest episode of Yellowstone or like gasping while we're reading a book on a plane. (laughs) Whatever that is, we're captivated till the very, very end. Now think more specifically about the last TV show that you binged. Whether that's a reality show, a drama series, comedy, the experience as a viewer, you virtually go through those same steps of this beginning, middle, and end of a story. Go with me on this one. You know that show whole experience that you feel when you've completed all the episodes in a show? You feel a little lost. You feel just a little out of it without that daily interaction of the characters. You may even start to picture what might happen next in the story. The overarching story of the ups and downs that these characters went through, again, no matter what the genre was, kept you engaged episode to episode. The storyline of the characters made you fall in love with them. You allowed yourself to get lost in this world in which this show exists. Not That might be a completely made up world, like, for example, the world of Hunger Games. That's made up. That is not something that is hopefully going to happen or that we'd find ourselves in that direct situation, but you're still drawn into the story based on how it's being delivered by the characters. Or if it's a reality show, say it's like the Housewives brand, you're not necessarily relating on the fact of their day-to-day lifestyle, but maybe you relate because you live in the same state, or you relate because you're also a mom, or you relate because you're also a wife and you go through similar things, or you just love the drama of it. Or it's like a modern family type ep- type of series where it's not real, but the world feels real and you kind of get lost in their day-to-day and It's even more relatable because of all the situations that they're going through. The plot points or the drama or the comedy, the cliffhangers in whichever show or genre had you hooked and maybe left you speechless or raised it and text your friends who also watched discuss the latest drama or the funniest thing that happened inside that episode or movie. What really has happened is you've been captivated by the brand of the show. We have to create these same experiences for our own brand. Whether your goal is to increase sales, boost engagement, increase your brand awareness, or all three, or something else, presenting your brand in this way that is attention-grabbing in a story format allows you to create this binge-worthy experience that your audience becomes obsessed with. And one that they also have an opportunity to be an active part of rather than just a viewer. So if they're engaging on your Instagram posts or they're commenting on your reels or they are joining your lives or they're commenting back to the emails you write or they're in your free Facebook group, 
or they're joining your services or buying your products. That is their opportunity to engage in your brand story and become a part of that brand story. And I'm going to give you a quick tip of how to start activating that principle now. Again, a story has a beginning, middle, and an end. So if, let's say you're launching a new program. The first part of this story that you want to tell is presenting that problem, is presenting the problem that your program or service is going to solve for your ideal client. Presenting this in a way that brings it to our attention. And maybe it's an issue that we know we have or we kind of ignored or pushing off to the side to be solved, but it's clear that we're having it or your ideal client is having it. And we want to bring that conversation to the surface. The middle part of that is offering is number one, relating it to yourself and telling them that you have been through this too. And then presenting, starting to present a solution of what becomes possible when they learn this method that happens inside your service and program. And the end of your story is you offering them point blank the solution to their problem. You've positioned yourself as the expert by telling them that you've been through this before, that you figured out a way that works, that's customizable to them and their and their whatever they're working through. But that's essentially it, is the beginning, middle, and end should be presented in these different portions of your marketing. Now super exciting. I've been hinting about this secret project, secret program for a very long time. If you follow me on social media, you know that this past Monday, we finally released our very first teaser for the program. And this program is called the Brand Rescue. This story marketing principle is exactly what we're teaching way more in depth and way more customizable for you to be able to adapt these principles to turn your brand into one that your audience is obsessed with and wants to binge. When somebody wants to binge something, they want everything that they, they can, they want to get their hands on everything they possibly can. Like for example, I just finished watching Yellowstone. What did I do right after I was finished? I Googled when's the next up, when is the next season coming out? What are these characters? I looked up every single character on Instagram. What are they doing now? Are they friends? (laughs) I want to know everything. And I found out that they have a podcast. So, of course, I started listening to that podcast. And with a little bit more searching, I found that they also have all this merch available for purchase. So, I want to be in on that community. And that, that feeling is what we need to create inside your brands. And that's exactly what we're doing inside this program. It is, you can either do it on your own. You'll have the opportunity to buy it as a course, a self-paced course, or there'll be the option to have a guided support with me for over a six month period and really take the time to go through these principles and learn them and put them into action. So I'm just gonna quickly go over the different parts that we have. It's broken up into six different parts, and there's, of course, you know, lots of details that goes in. <laughs> the first part, we wanna audit your brand, take a look at where your brand currently stands and where you wanna take your brand next and what, if any, adjustments may need to be made to help you reach those goals sooner rather than later. Then we're gonna move into reestablishing your brand guidelines and just making sure that... The way you're running your business, the back end is quote unquote on brand for you. If there's something that's not working or there's a system that you no longer are using or there's just ways that we can improve how you're running the day to day, that's what we're going to discuss there. And then the next part, we'll get into story marketing and really, really, really understanding the foundations of storytelling to define who you are and how you want to be presenting this story as it relates to your brand as a whole and also a particular service that you want to be promoting. Then we'll be moving into story building and we're actually laying the outline for the story you're going to be using. Then we're going to be taking action. I'm going to guide you step by step on using these principles, using these tools, using these resources compiling every component of your story, defining your characters, your hero, your guide, your plot points, your obstacles, all of this as it relates to your marketing plan. And we're going to be rolling it out together. Hand in hand, you've got the support the whole time. We're also going to be doing a module on fostering engagement and how to extend your brand experience to create an inclusive and engaging community that feels 
exclusive to the experience they have with your brand. And it's a one of a kind experience that they can't get anywhere else. So I've been really, really excited about this, but this isn't just your average course, not your average program, it's not your average coaching program. You're not going to be getting a access to modules where I'm sitting in front of the computer and teaching on a subject, which are amazing and which are great. And I've taken a lot of them and they're really valuable, but I wanted to do something a little bit different. <laughs> and you guys know how much I love TV and how much I love storytelling, clearly. So we are, and you're only getting access to this information here for the next couple of weeks. I'm not telling this anywhere else, so you should feel special. I'm actually playing out these scenarios and playing out these modules and information that I'm teaching inside our own TV show. <laughs> so you'll see there'll be more teasers coming out, but I'm essentially playing two parts. And both of those parts are kind of speaking to two sides of entrepreneurship that we are constantly going through. Of the, the one side that's always adding ourselves and the other side that's telling us to get it together. <laughs> So it's it's just a different way to experience this these lessons and experience these this teaching and communicate the teaching, communicate the lessons and drive home the point and display the point of what I really want somebody to take away who's a part of this course. It's just something different. It's something that's totally on brand for myself and I'm really really excited about it. I haven't been excited about a program I've been launching in a very long time and I'm excited about the material number one, and I'm excited about the possibility of the transformation of what could happen, what I know will happen when somebody understands these principles and really puts them into play. So that was a long-winded, but uh, again, I consider this community on my podcast a very special one, and I appreciate all the support and the people who I don't even know who are listening, but listen every week. Um, so I wanted you guys to be the first to hear about it and first to really understand a little bit more of the depths of it. So if you want or are interested in checking it out, the waitlist is now open. We're just doing a waitlist for now. There's absolutely no obligation to join the program once enrollment actually opens. It's really just a way to gauge who might be interested because there will be limited spots in the guided program portion of it. Um, so we want to just make sure that we are offering that to those who may have strong interest in it first. But um, you can go over to the, to the website and learn more about it and learn kind of what it looks like right now. Ask me any questions you may have. You always know where to find me. And again, I appreciate you tuning in and having listen. And I hope whatever you do, you choose one thing today to move your brand and business forward. I will chat with you guys soon.